Hunter Collector here with another video. Before the video starts, I want to let you guys know to make sure you hit that subscribe and notification button. It really helps out showing the support for the channel. I do a bunch of other stuff besides gaming. I do drawing, building, collecting, uh, workouts, cooking, um, and then a bunch of other cool stuff with my friends. Um, and if you want to, me to put, be posting more videos each day, make sure you hit that subscribe button and let me know. Uh, but besides that, let's get right into the video. Alright, this is Hunter Collector here with another uh, Marvel Legends review. Uh, this is Sh Shik Shikla um, from the X-Force Wave Deadpool. Uh, that makes the Strongman uh, build a fear. And here she is uh in the front it comes with a shark and it comes with strong guy a strong man's arm one of the arms i don't know which one yet um so there it is from the front here's the side art here's the back and if you want to pause and read this you can and then here's the figure starting away with blue deadpool um black tom uh chicla um, I forgot his name again. I gotta look. Marvel Legends. Oh yeah, Maverick. And then the one we already um, reviewed. Uh, Sunspot. Uh, Warpath. And then Pirate Deadpool. So yeah. And then the other side, the same thing. There's the top with a Deadpool logo. And then here's the bottom with the DCPI. Uh, but besides that, let's crack this thing open. All right, here's Chicla out of the packaging. I already have some problems with it, so I'll explain that when we get to it. But the accessory that she comes with is the shark. I don't think, I don't know if it has any articulation at all, but yeah, I don't think it does at all. Yeah, none. Um, but just a basic shark right there with legs. Good job with the teeth. Pretty cool. And then you just get him to sit and stand there. Pretty cool. Alright, so to go over Shikla now, because that's the only one minus the uh, strong man's arm. So she, her face looks good. Oh, if it focuses. She scares the camera a little bit, apparently. Uh, but she, they did a really good job on the head sculpt, that's for sure. The hair looks good. Just nice black gold dragon or bat thing for her hair I think this little crown on her head nice purple detail with the pink for the skin tone and this is a separate piece the necklace so it has some red diamond or jewels wherever it is it's with some gold around it and then it has she has these sleeves gold bracelets gold detailing there's some little black splotch right there but not, nothing bad. And something cool about this, they came with a soft uh, fabric, or not really soft, it's more like, it's like one of those ribbons. It's like that ribbon material. So it's not really soft, it's just something to add in, I guess, um, instead of having the plastic. I probably would have liked the plastic for one reason. I'll say why in here in a bit. And then they got this nice purple detail around the suit. Really nice, the legs look good. Some gold detail around there. And then boots look good, their heels. Um, but besides that, that's really it. Oh yeah, uh, this little belt thing too. With some red jewels and then some gold. Pretty cool. Let's go over articulation, which I do have problems with. Oh yeah, oh, I didn't see that. She has earrings too. But her head can move down, I think. There we go. She can move her head down that far. Her head up. Oh, Jesus. I don't want to break her. Like that much without the hair getting away. With the hair getting away. And then you get side to side motion. You get some head pivot there a little bit. You get her arms to go out that far, which is nice, further than 90 degrees, 360 rotation. But then it kind of messes with the cape a little bit. 
uh, she gets a single jointed elbow and then you fix that. They should have double jointed. Uh, and then you get to uh, swivel it the other way a little bit if you want. Wrist can hinge down that far, up that far, and a 360 rotation. Um, and she has a diaphragm joint on the top of the torso. So you get her to pivot that far to the side. You could get her to go forward like zero and backwards a bit, which is nice. So they could have done a little bit better on that one. You could get her legs to kick out that far. Kick forward really good. And then backwards, like none. She has a thigh cut. She has double jointed knees. And then her ankles can hinge down that far, up that far, like like no ankle pivot. That's the problem I have. So when I try to get her to stand up, it's kind of like impossible. That's why I would say like they could should have went for a plastic cape thing, but then I guess it would kind of mess up with the whole arm moving thing, I guess, which kind of would suck. Uh, focus. There we go. Um, but that's the problem. You can barely get her to balance like that. But it looks cool. Just articulation is a problem. Uh, mainly, it's some minor paint mess ups, but I'm okay with that. Cool shark accessory. Um, and I like what they did with for the soft uh, good there. And that really soft, I guess. What did I say? Uh, like I didn't even touch the damn thing. And, and like the little cape and it just falls. I would think that would barely do anything to it. Let's see if I can get her to stand up again now. This is a problem with her. She can't stand up. There we go. I guess I got her to stand up pretty good there. Um, but that's cool what they did for the soft good there. Like I said, it's just ribbon material though. So it probably can easily rip. So probably want to be careful with that one, but really that's all I've got for her. I don't know much about her either. So yeah. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you check out my buddy's Instagram page at Highlight Photos. He does really cool photos. Also my two best friends that I usually play Call of Duty with, sometimes with other games. They have card pages. Christian's card page is BadBuke767. Uh, Connor's card page, well, he doesn't really have one at the moment. His Jeep's gone. He has a new car. I will update it when he like decides to put up an Instagram page for it. Um, to uh, sending, donating to my PayPal, it's supposed to help me out with getting get me being able to do that and I'll also get more games uh, to do reactions to. When I get the PS5, uh, I'll do a review on it. And then also the games for it, um, more camera, better camera equipment, uh, and a few other things to help make the views a little bit better. And then uh, I will try putting up my own merch store at some point. I just need time to do it. I'm in the middle of baseball right now. I will figure out some way to do it. I do not have a laptop myself at the moment. So if you guys could help me out by donating to my PayPal, it would be really awesome. But besides that, um, if you really enjoy my nerdy, funny, gaming, uh, workout, uh, sports videos, other stuff like that, uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.